Incoming transmission standby, welcome to the Nod News Network. Romania's Deputy Chief of General Staff said it would deploy radar and 600 soldiers on the border with Ukraine. Deputy Chief of General Staff Georgia Vlad said on Friday that the Romanian armed forces are ready to shoot down Russian unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs. He told Sweden's SVT2 channel that Bucharest would also deploy additional forces in the Danube Delta near the Ukrainian border. We have decided to deploy about 600 soldiers to strengthen our defenses in northern Dobroja, Vlad said, referring to Romania's eastern coastal region, which borders Ukraine to the north. The border between Ukraine and Romania runs along the Danube River. According to the general, additional radar systems were also deployed in the area and local air defense forces were placed on alert. Romania has also held discussions with other NATO member states about its potential response to what Vlad described as possible Russian aggression. When asked whether Romania is ready to use air defense systems against Russian drones, the general replied that Romania is ready to use all military power to defend Romanian territory. He added that the exact answer would depend on the level of threat. Romania's Ministry of Defense on Thursday restricted flights over northern Dobroja and especially near the border with Ukraine. He also announced the construction of two bomb shelters in the Plorusia Taltru region, located directly opposite Ismail, Ukraine's largest river port in the Danube Delta. Earlier this week, Bucharest announced that debris from a suspected Russian drone had been discovered in the area. President Klaus Johannes said at the time, if it is confirmed that the remains belong to a Russian drone, the situation would be completely unacceptable and would constitute a serious violation of sovereignty and territorial integrity of Romania. Kiev said on Monday that a Russian drone crashed in Romania during an attack on Ismail. Romania's Ministry of Defense initially denied this claim. Moscow has not commented on the incident. Russia began targeting port infrastructure in Odessa and other Ukrainian Black Sea cities in July, following Kiev's maritime drone attack on a bridge connecting Crimea to mainland Russia. The attack left two civilians dead and a minor injured. This has been the Nod News Network, transmission complete.